One, two, three, fuck it. So I've been working as a software engineer for the past five months now and I got this job right after graduating from college. So I'm here in New York City and if you're wondering why I can work from home, it's because the work I do is largely project based and my team is spread out all over the United States. So we get all our calls and meetings done online, so pretty much I could work from anywhere. But my company does have an office in the city and I'm actually going to head there right now. About two months ago, I made an apartment tour video of my place's house kitchen, and just recently it blew up and it's getting a ton of comments, but a lot of hate comments, and people are saying that I should have moved to the Bronx or Brooklyn and save a lot of money. But I don't know, I really like living in Manhattan, especially having a boosted board and having a commute where I'm able to go through the heart of the city. I don't know, maybe just because I'm new to New York, but I really like this. So I live on 9th Avenue, which is the west side of Manhattan, and my work is in the east side of Manhattan, which is in Park Avenue. So it's about four or five avenues away, and that's about a 25 minute walk. But with the boosted board, I get to work in like less than five minutes. So I work back there, that's Park Avenue, but right now I'm gonna get some lunch, bring the food to my office, and eat over there. So I'm here at work, I'm gonna put the vlog away because I don't know if I can film in there, I might get in trouble. And I'll see you guys at five o'clock. So the time right now is 5.30. I just got off work, right now I'm heading home and I got a few more stuff to do today. So this is my first job out of college. I graduated in May, I was class of 2019. And I got this job and they wanted me to start literally two weeks after commencement. So right after graduating, I drove down from Boston to New York and I started my career. So I work 40 hours a week full time as a front end software developer. And what a front end software developer does is that they code everything that you see in the front end of a website or an application. So it's almost 6 o'clock and I got a little bit more work to do. Other than working full time as a software developer, I also freelance a good amount as a photographer and a videographer. So the other day I shot a engagement photo shoot and I need to edit those photos and videos and send it back to my clients. So I'm gonna pack up my stuff and go to a nearby coffee shop or a boba shop and continue my work from over there. So I've been freelancing as a photographer and videographer for maybe like five years now, ever since I got to college. And I'm really making it a point to do it a lot here in Manhattan because you know, everything is super expensive. So for example, this weekend I have a wedding to shoot and I'm really trying to make it a point to aim to make as much money as rent is off of freelancing alone. And that way my actual salary could be used for savings and just for other things. coolest things about this job and about working remotely is that since my team is all remote and everyone that I need to report to is online, I could take my laptops and pretty much go to different cities and just work from there. So I found my editing station for the next two hours. I'm gonna be in here.
So usually I go to the gym at this time, but instead I'm just gonna eat and finish my edits. <laughs> Yo, I'm here. <laughs> oh, what's up? What's up, big boy? <laughs> I also brought something I could like pull you with. <laughs> what's up, guys? This is my friend Elliot. Hi. He's, he's here for like two days for a, for a conference. And he's staying like super near me. I think he only hangs out with me because I have a boosted board. That's pretty I don't much know true. yet. That's true. So we're on our way to Times Square and Elliot wants to shoot something for his video. So we're about to go. We got our cameras and our boards. Looking like full-time YouTube vloggers. You think you're back? <laughs> you're going pretty fast. We're uphill. Yo, Elliot, what are you doing? That's how you go 20 miles an hour on a skateboard. Alright guys, thank you for watching today's Day in the Life of a Software Engineer. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's now 1 a.m. and... Mom, did you film that at all? No. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you for watching today's Day in the Life. It's now... 1 a.m. and we're in Times Square. We just wrapped up our photos and videos. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next week. <laughs>